Andrea Filoni, who's also a director. So let me know what you guys think about that in the comments below. Right, moving on and moving on to the next bit of news, which is that WandaVision fans think the Marvel Studios series is teasing Magneto's arrival. So why do they think this? Well, it's actually not in the... It's in the episode before last, episode two, is where um, people think they've seen this tease. And it comes... It comes actually during the the magic show that they put on, that, that, that Wanda and Vision put on. And during that magic show, so I'll just get it up. Vision says, he Vision refers to a cabinet of mysteries as a magnet of crystories. And in other words, a magnet of or magneto. <laughs> magneto. Yeah, magnet of magneto. So fans are now thinking that this is a direct reference to magneto. But this isn't the only reason why people are thinking that Magneto will be involved in the show. It's actually one of the other reasons is because um, Paul Bettany actually revealed that he got to work with a um, an actor that he's already always wanted to work with in WandaVision. And um, this, let me just get the quote up here. He was talking to... Uh, da -da -da. So he was talking to who was he talking to? The thing is, there's a lot of um. Right, where did I find it? It was it says a major actor hasn't been leaked yet. Here we go. Consent. So um, he said, so many things get leaked, but there's this thing that has been completely under wraps that happens. I work with this actor. I've always wanted to work with. And we really have fireworks together. The scenes are great. And I think people are going to be really excited. I've always wanted to work with this guy. And the scenes are pretty intense. So who is this actor that uh, that Paul Bettany always wanted to work with? Well, I, I looked through his... Um, uh, his uh, well, the films he's been in. Sorry, it's quite late here. <laughs> um, and he hasn't worked with a particular actor that is has been involved in the Marvel movies before. And that's Sir Ian McKellen. And if you're British, Sir Ian McKellen is a is a is a national treasure, and uh, he's obviously someone that a lot of actors would love to work with. But he doesn't actually work. He doesn't. He do, he does a lot of stuff. But he, obviously, an actor like Paul Bettany might not always get the chance or the opportunity to work with him. I was thinking the possibility of two actors. I was thinking it's between Sir Patrick Stewart and Sir Ian McKellen. I think that this Magneto tease means that Magneto is going to be turning up in One Division, and actually it'll be Mag uh, Magneto played by Sir Ian McKellen. In the article, I was kind of like, I'm not so sure if it's going to be Ian McKellen because that means that that would have been quite a difficult um, thing to to just shoot, especially with COVID. But actually, a lot of WandaVision was shot before all of that and they might have just got that out of the way and done really early. And the other reason why I think uh, Magneto is a really good shout is actually because Magneto in the comics is Wanda Maximoff's father. So this, I think, would be a really interesting thing to to kind of explore in this WandaVision show. I am asking around, but it's, it's really, really kept under wraps and uh, these sorts of things. Uh, Marvel is very, very careful to make sure that this this doesn't this doesn't leak. But I'm let's say I am seventy percent sure this is happening. And if I get any information on it, I will let you know as soon as I as soon as I do. But you know, you've heard it here. I think uh, Sir Ian McKellen is going to be turning up as Magneto in the WandaVision series. I think that's the actor that he's alluding to. But let me know what you guys think about that in the comments below. Right, moving on from WandaVision and on to AMC. So 